Hey guys, what's up? It's Kamaras, and welcome to your RuneScape 2007 quest guide for Tears of Gothics. So for this quest, you'll need some sort of light source. I'm using a Bullseye Lantern. You're also going to need a Bullseye Lantern with a Cut Sapphire. We'll be combining them later. Um, you're also going to need a Chisel, a Tinderbox, and a Pickaxe. For my guide, we're going to be doing the method where we have already completed the Lost Tribe quest. If you haven't completed that quest, this is not the guide for you. Alright, so to start this quest, simply head down to the tunnels below the Lumbert's Castle, and then head south. And there will be this tunnel here that you cleared during the Lost Tribe quest. Now if it's blocked, just go ahead and use your pickaxe on it and that will clear it. Now we can squeeze through. Alright, now from here, run south. And we need to jump over this stepping stone here. Now if you have candles and you fell on this, your candle will go out. Just quickly use your tinderbox on it to relight it um, so you don't get hit too much. Uh, if you have a bullseye lantern though, it won't go out. Go ahead and enter in this tunnel here and then run east. Climb down these rocks. and talk to Juna. Pick the first option. Now let's go ahead and run back northwest here. Now use your sapphire on your bullseye lantern and it will give you a sapphire lantern. Feel free to drop your lens and then use your tinderbox on the lantern to light it and then use the sapphire lantern on any one of these light creatures. Now once you're across there's a bunch of rocks here. Go ahead and mine any of them. And you're going to get a magic stone. Use your magic stone on the chisel to get a stone bowl. Go ahead and use your Sapphire Lantern again on any of these light creatures to get back across. Now let's head back east to Juna. Talk to Juna to finish the quest. Thank you guys for watching, and until next time, love, peace, and chicken grease.